Hi, my name is Jared Kimball. I'm with Spamspurt.com, uh, email marketing training. Right here, I'm a, I've made this quick video for Ivan Garrity. I believe I said the last name correctly, Ivan. I apologize if I didn't, but um, Ivan, this your question was, uh, how do I create an action set when I add a tag? For example, I have a prospect that now is a customer and needs new actions. So in other words, they're gonna, from my understanding of this question is, you want to create an action set when you add a tag. Um, you're basically converting them from prospect to customer, so they've bought a product from you. And I'll go ahead and show you how this is accomplished. Go ahead and get that out of the way. So on your home page, what we have to do is we have to define the action set. We have to create it. So we'll go to setup, and then we'll go to action sets. And what we're going to do is we're going to add an action set. So select that there. Bring over our window. We give it a name. I'm going to go ahead and call this Ivan's Action Set. That way he's got a name there. And then we're going to build the actions. So now basically this, this action set, what it's going to do is it's going to automatically happen whenever we set it up in certain areas in the software to where it's going to, uh, we want them to remove the prospect tag and add the customer tag. So the first action we're going to do is we're going to select apply remove tag and we're going to select remove tags and then we're going to select prospects and then click save. So now that one's removed the next thing we're going to do is we're going to apply remove tag again and this time keep apply tag selected and then we're going to select customers right there and then we'll click save. So now this action set what it does is it removes the prospects tag, adds the customers tag. So now whenever Ivan does a search and he just wants to search for people who have customers tags, he can find all those people based off this action set. So we'll go ahead and save it. The action set is now built, it's established, and ready to go. Now to use this somewhere, hypothetically, uh, most likely what you'll do is uh, it'll be whenever a customer purchase is a product so they've moved from prospect to customer but just for keeping this simple I'll go ahead and show you how to um, run this in well let's go ahead in here if we go to kind of kind of going off script here uh, let's say probably where would be the best way to do it if we go to shopping cart and in here in our shopping cart we'll go to checkout area and we're going to go to other settings I believe this is where it's at wrong place. It's right here, purchase actions. So where we have purchase actions. So now whenever an action is applied, so we can say specific products, which these are all of your products here, um, default, you know, so for example, we're going to say successful purchase action. This will be the best option for this, for your question, Ivan. So we're going to click actions here. So right here we have a chain action set. I'm going to go and just remove that one. Take that one off. We're going to add a new action. So the new action we're going to do is we're going to copy actions from a saved action set. If you wanted to, you could actually just put the actions right here in this spot. But if this is something you do in a number of different places, like say for specific products, this comes in handy. You already have it created. So we just select in the drop down menu see if it will take me to eyes. We have Ivan's action set. So we'll go ahead and copy these actions. Click OK. There we go. Remove prospects, add customers. We click save. So now whenever there is a successful purchase action in the shopping cart, they will now have their prospects tag removed and a customer's tag added. Again, this is Jared Kimball. Ivan, I hope that helps you out and explain things better. Feel free to just add more questions if you want. Post comments on my blog, uh, spamspurt.com. That's S-P-E as an echo, R-T dot com, spamspurt.com. Good talking to you guys. Feel free to add your comments, and I uh, hope this helps you out, Ivan.